Oh boy. Oh boy, it's go time. It's go time. Yeah, I hear you, brother. I hear ya. Alright, good morning. Welcome to another episode with the Unkempt Gamer, Green Hell. Building bases in unique places. Thank you so much for tuning in. As you can see, it looks, whoops, it looks like we got a little growth here coming back. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, let's drink this bad boy up. We're going to address our vitals really quickly. Um, yes, which we definitely want to do. I think what I'm going to do right now, right this second, I'm just going to go ahead and drink this. <clears throat> get that out of the way. Uh, we st Whoa, what the heck? I didn't get a lot of... I wonder what kind of meat I put in there. Didn't really get a lot. No big deal. No problem. We've got plenty of those. I thought we were going to have a problem with fats here, but apparently not. Yeah, these are all going to have to go. And yeah, we'll nibble on a couple others. We'll save these other ones that give us energy as we lose energy. we still got a bit of time on them, and we are doing great. And I think I'm just going to leave that guy there. Let's do this. Remember, no short supply of sticks around here, that's for sure. But yeah, it looks like some of the growth is coming back. A couple of things I want to accomplish today, you know, as uh, this is a new series, um, as I'd mentioned in the last video, this is, <clears throat> excuse me, this is episode two, and I'm just going to be building bases and out of the way places on the map, uh, just having a little fun with it, uh, trying something a little different. And over here, we've already started building our structure. And I think what I'm going to do is today I'd like to build a dryer over here, a dry rack. And I'm considering leaving this small area open and then building around it like so, so that we kind of have just almost like a little open air, you know, courtyard area, debating whether I should build a water filter there, maybe a, um, a bath, a shower, a mud shower. Um, I think that would look kind of cool. And another thing that I want to do, I don't know if we'll be able to get all this done today, but... Um, I'd really like to build a stick rack because look at all these sticks everywhere from all the trees we've been taking down. Plus it'll be nice to be able to go out there, just down a bunch of, you know, long sticks for example, and just put them, uh, put them right in that rack and use them whenever I need to. But let's get this fire stoked and going just so we have it throughout the day. Water, we're okay. Eh, you know what? I'll, I'll put the remaining water in here. We're probably going to need it. There we go. Huh. Oh, okay. Spill. Looks like there's a little bug there. Alright, perfect. And... Do I want to make another... You know, I'm still debating on what to do with that coconut. I haven't drank it yet, so we'll get to that, of course. But, um... Not just yet. Let's see here. I'm going to put the dryer right here. I think this is a good spot for it. And we'll get to it. That way we also have another reason I want to build a dryer. is because I don't really have a lot of space on the... Um, I don't have a lot of space over there uh, with the fire. You only have two spots. And here you have like seven. So... Let's get her done. So what do we need here? We need seven long boys, eleven ropes, uh, eleven small sticks, and three eee, three bone needles. Okay, no problem. So it looks like we'll be doing some hunting today as well. <laughs> no problem. We got you. So let's get some more long boys. We need to clear this area out anyway. And I'm thinking we are going to be building a new axe in our future. I think that believes... Bleh, I think that believes no. I believe that is going to be on the menu very soon, very shortly. Where's the other guy? Here you are, buddy. Let's get you. Let's get you on the dryer. Let's try to at least. Come on, buddy. We have to kneel down now? That's not going to work. I just got to get close. Okay. The dryer does not want to be built. But we will build you, sir. Oh my goodness, why am I having so much trouble with this? That's hilarious. Ah! 
That's hilarious. Okay, we need two more. Oh, and look at this. This guy grew back. We cleared this one out in the first episode. And, uh, <laughs> and that guy grew back too. Cool. Awesome. Pick you up. Oh, okay. There's a lot of carbs around here. That's good. You just have to know where to look, you know? Um, they're just right in front of you. Need a couple more long boys right here, and I think this axe is gonna at least work through. Yeah, okay, good. We only got maybe two, three, four. Whoops, two, three, four swings left on this bad boy. No problem. My biggest thing that my most biggest unforeseen thing about this, I totally forgot. You need hooks. <laughs> this is fantastic. Let me tell you, trying to build something. But it just won't let me put the sticks down. Oh, whoa, how the... Okay, all right. We're going to do it that way? Well, then maybe we got to do it this way. <laughs> no, you don't want to? You don't want to? My kingdom for a freaking... Uh, oh! <laughs> this is insane. All right. <laughs> Did not realize it was going to be that difficult. Okay. Now, what are we doing next? We're doing ropes. Okay, we got to get a boatload of ropes. Come on, buddy. Why is this so hard to target? I swear it hasn't been this difficult in the past. Bizarre. Okay. Our little rope factory over here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's go time. It's go time. Yeah, I hear you, brother. I hear ya. Looks like somebody's doing a little recon. Looks like he's alone. Okay. So, where were we? <laughs> Ropes, right? <laughs> You know, this guy might have something, some sort of cut. There he is. This guy might have some sort of cutting tool on him. Oh, and you know what? He's definitely going to have bones on him. So this was quite fortuitous. Ugh, I don't want to carve him up. But I'm going to have to. It's going to get me very, very dirty. And I think I lost, I think I missed him once. No, I, okay, cool. Hit him three times. I thought I missed him once. So, tribal bow. That's at 100%. This one's at 20. I'm just going to leave it right here. Um, okay, yeah, this is a bow guy. I guess he... Oh, there we go. There we go. That's what's up right there. This guy's at 5%. I'm just going to go ahead and destroy him. This one is at 99%. Fantastic. I mean, sorry, buddy. You know, you kind of brought this on yourself, but um, thank you. Ugh, I don't want to do this next part, but I'm going to have to. Okay. Let's, uh, let's get you done, buddy. Mmm, my favorite. And, of course, we are overloaded. Okay, so let's just destroy this nastiness. Okay, perf. Okay, good. Good. Okay, I, th I thought we were just going to be, like, totally overweight no matter what. And might as well get this get this guy in the brew. Um, okay, we've got four bones. That's more than enough. I don't need... Whoops. I don't need all these feathers. Um... Yeah, these are still pretty durable, so I'm just going to burn all those. I think you just... Har do you harvest it? To get the bone hook? Let's see. We've got plenty. Let's see what this does. Bone needle, and then maybe we craft... Yes, okay, cool. There we go. So we've got our bone hooks. We've got our bone hooks. We can handle that. Whew, but first, if you notice right here, we are dirty, dirty, dirty. We gotta change that. We gotta we gotta fix that right now, pronto. Ooh. There's armor okay. So we can make armor with those boys. 
You, oh my goodness, gosh. Me and snakes, man. Why did it have to be snakes? <laughs> yeah, this is gonna, I mean, I'm glad there's a water source nearby, but this is really gonna be like the only pain in the butt is having to walk back and forth so far away from a water source. But the good news is, is we've got a water source. You know, if it was the rainy season, it wouldn't be that big of a deal, but I'm guessing right now it's not the rainy season. Um, and uh, that's why we're having so many struggles having to go back and forth. And there is something creeping. Okay. And let's do this. Fill you up. I might need to make a badon out of this. Yeah, just because of the water situation. Let's do that. Craft. I wanted to make more bowls, but no. We're not going to do that right now. Okay. What is no, that? Bad idea. Oh, the, he's in the water. That's adorable. Oh, looks like we got some honey over there, too. That's good. So if we ever need that... Gone get. Okay, let's get back to what we were doing, which is some rope wrangling, if I remember correctly. And we got our bones, and we got our more durable weapons, which is fantastic. And, uh, yeah, let's get to it. Oh my, why is this so difficult to target? I swear this has never been an issue in the past. Like, this is a problem, man. This, I don't like it. <laughs> no, sir, I don't like it. Not one bit. Okay. And I think if we just load up on these, we'll be good. Because we needed 11, and I think we've put 3 down. So we need at least 8 at minimum. Okay. And there's some more over here. And I think this will do us. Yeah. If not, close enough, Ryan. I think this puts us at... Okay, no, we'll put us at 10. And then we'll have a couple of ropes to grow on. So good stuff. Good stuff. I appreciate his contribution to the cause. <laughs> okay, it's kind of, kind of dark, but we're technically using human bones uh, to hang meat on the dryer. Just giving y'all a heads up. Um, wonderful. Okay, yeah, this is really starting to annoy me. Like, this, I don't remember this ever being an issue. If y'all know what I'm doing wrong, please drop a comment down or in the, yeah, in the comment section. Give me some advice. Because this is just taking way too long. It's unacceptable. And I would like to speak with the manager, please. <laughs> uh, okay. All right, Mr. Leach, where you at, homeboy? You don't gotta go home, but you can't stay here. And how many sticks do I have? I need to just play more. Oh, small sticks. Okay. Cool. So we got plenty of sticks everywhere. Let's just harvest the heck out of these, and we'll still probably need a couple more. And I want to keep. Let's see, harvest. Let's just let's just do them all because there's some regular size sticks over there as well. So we need two more. No problem. Just pick up two regular size sticks. Eh. One to grow on. God, they're everywhere. Yeah. And we'll harvest one more. Oops. See, look at this. This is this is bizarre. I wonder if it's just how I've got the structure shut set up. I don't know, but that's not cool. Oh, okay. Looks like we have it. Or we did. I saw it go the the affirmative yellow or whatever color that is. Bizarre. Bizarre. Come on, there we go. Ah! And the hookerinos. Oh, I bet this is going to be fun. I can't believe I'm going to spend like half the day 
it's like trying to like set up furniture from Ikea or something basically this is ridiculous and harvest and I think you know you, we you should always keep a bone bone needle on you at all times anyway so um, you know when you get worms it usually means you're lost I wish you could just ugh, okay you can Ooh. Come on. Oh, oh no. Okay. <laughs> I read that wrong. You need bone. Okay. There we go. Okay, so now I've got a bunch of bone hooks that I don't need. That's okay. There we go. We could always use you. Eh. Yeah. Eh, I don't think we're going to need those, but we'll keep it there. All right, so cool. So we've got our dryer set up. Um, we spent way too much freaking time on that. That's really irritating. Um, might as well. We're not dirty, so that's good. Might as well use this time to address some of our vitals. Oh, and we could use some energy, most definitely. These are about to go anyway. You see how these mushrooms, they boost your energy just a little bit but it's nice it puts you just over the top we're gonna need to eat all these anyway okay one more what the heck was that the world may never know okay so where were we fats man we are almost out of freaking food <laughs> these are getting ready to die anyway blah yeah, we'll hold on to that one just for a little bit longer, even though it's probably going to rot. Okay, so we've got that. We need some Wawa. Do we need any more carbs? No. So let's just drink this bad boy, fill her up one more time, and, uh, man, that really took it out of us. But, of course, we did, like, you know, kill somebody, too. So, zzz, what the heck was that? Sure, it was an iguana or something. Okay, no problem, no problem. So we're gonna drink you. We're good to go. Is there still some in there? Okay. I guess that's all he needed. Okay. Let's just drink her up. Boom. So yeah, I think what we need to do in preparation is now we're, we're kind of forced to hunt. I know there was some other stuff that I wanted to do, but we've got our dry rack, which is important. Yeah, it does have seven spots on it. We won't need fire after this. I mean, we are going to need fire to boil water and things like that, but we won't need it to cook and boil water once we get a good rotation in. So I think what I'm going to do... Ye he he. I mean, there's not a lot to this guy, but we might as well take him anyway because also we're removing him as a threat. He gives us two rattlesnake steaks, if I remember correctly. So, that's not a bad thing. And it doesn't get us dirty, which I will fully embrace. I think that's probably a bug, because other stuff... Oh, shoo! Wow, wow, you see that? Okay. Not the best meat, but he's definitely in our way. I don't know. Okay, maybe if he just stays over there. I don't want to go chase him. Ah, sorry, buddy. I lost him. Saying I don't want to chase him down if I have to, but then I remembered... He might path in my campsite area, so that can be a problem. Well, let's do this. Let's get that guy. He's down. Oh boy, yeah, he's right frickin' there. He's pathing through here. He doesn't see me yet. Okay, maybe he's not pathing through here. Beautiful, beautiful, very realistic. You know, daylight's burning. Let's get this taken care of. Hopefully it won't make us too overweight. 
and it does okay oh not too much okay now we're good so look at that it's kind of cool to just observe I don't know how close he gets to us let's do this let's wash up So like maybe he just paths over in that area, I'm not sure. Don't get me wrong, I wouldn't mind killing him, but it's nice to observe his behavior too, to know what to expect when traveling in this area. So we know at least over in that area, that's a problem. But again, I'm still kind of nervous because he might path. Ooh, just what the doctor freaking ordered. Okay, yeah, this is about to go away. Let's eat that. There's one. There's the other one. Good. So we've got some fats. I mean, we've got meat now, but the problem is, is it's going to take a couple of days to dry, and I just saw these drop as well. So what we can do in the meantime, while the other meat cooks, is we can also... Um, dry some of the peccary meat up here. We'll dry one of the rattlesnakes. We've got two peccary, two rattlesnakes. So what we can do is we can allow those to dry while we work in a rotation of meats, both smoked and cooked. And let's see here. Yeah, we could use some carbs. Why not? Boom. Okay. So what we could do, just take this guy off. What's that? This is going to take longer to cook. That's fully hydrated. And no, I don't want to put that in there. So we've got that cooking. <laughs> While it's cooking, four sticks. <laughs> Bone hook. Yay. Okay. So while it's cooking, stand small sticks. Four, okay, and two rope. Okay. Get a couple of rope real quick. And I'm debating where I should put the small sticks. I mean, we can always move it, so I guess it's not that big of a deal. Might as well put it next to the fire. It's my thought. Because we're not really going to need... Yeah, let's just... Hmm. Yeah, we can, I don't know why I'm fussing so much. We can always just make another one later if we need to. Boom. There we go. Okay, and that's halfway done. And we're slowly losing daylight. Man, those, uh, that stuff really put a damper on our day, didn't it? But it all also it, it it helped us find a solution for uh, that little problem we were having. Oh, you know what? I got a great idea. Okay, so this guy, yeah, this guy's about done. But let's do this. Let's pick this guy up. Let's make a soup out of the moringa, and we'll be good to go. We'll have a little little carb drop off spot. Yeah, right there. Nice little carb infusion if and when we need it. So, peccary's almost done. Wish we would have gotten more accomplished today, that's for sure. But, um, ah, you know what else I can do? Let's see here. Right here, yeah, what I'm going to do, just so I can have just some quick access to proteins, I'm just going to set a little trap right here. Make use of the stone. That guy's set. We don't really have anything. I guess we can put one of these boys in here. And that way I can just check on this from time to time. If and when, uh, you know, I'm in between getting different protein types. And it'll make for a quick little snack. I don't know if that thing will catch iguanas or not. I'm not 100% sure. But I know it'll catch smaller stuff like, you know, frogs and mice and unfortunately spiders. <laughs> there we go. Peccary is done. 
We still got almost a day on that. These are we got plenty of time on those. And that snake cooks up pretty quick. So with the regular size sticks, let's do this. How are we doing on our vitals? Our vitals are okay. So I think what we're gonna do. We'll just put the regular sticks over here. <laughs> it's so weird, just that in this area the targeting is very challenging. Okay, so we'll set this guy up. Small sticks, regular sticks. Boom. Right there. No problem. Okay. And we are back in business when it comes to the meat situation. A little water right there for us. And let's see here. Let's oops. Let's get the fire taken care of. And what we should do, so we need what, three long sticks? Yeah. Did we get all the ropes? Yeah, we sure did. Oh yeah, this guy's getting ready to break. I think it's gonna break. One more swing. Make that two. One. Where'd the other one go? There you are, long boy. And yeah. Let's find one more. There we go. Here's this guy right here. And as you can see, it's getting dark. For oh, Wait. No. Yeah. You've got to be kidding me. No problem, young man. We've got just what the doctor ordered. It's not quite as good as an obsidian, but uh, it'll it'll get the job done. Gonna eat these right off the log. Because why the heck not, right? Give us that energy boost. It's going to help with stamina. Yeah, that one's a little too big now that I look at it a little more closely. And we'll pick these up. Doop -a -doop -a -doo. There we go. Ah, here we go. This is the one I had my eye on. Takes a little, a couple, uh, one extra swing, you know, to get these guys down with the stone axe versus the obsidian, but that's okay. I think over there, I just saw an iguana take off. Okay, whatever. Whatever, buddy. Have your fun. Yeah. An extra rope or two never hurt anybody, right? Whoops. And there we go. We've got our little stick holders. Whoops. I'm going to set this guy here. If I do build um, log holders and long... Yep, yep, I just saw him take off that over there. If we do build uh, long stick holders and log holders, um, it's, um, it's going to be up here. I'm going to keep them up here. So, okay, Leecherino time. Where you at, homeboy? There y'all are. Yeah, I'll get away. Okay, good times, good times. So, do we have enough time? We kinda do. So, let's do this. Let's let's pop another structure on here for old time's sake. What do you say? Boom. And let's get to it. Um, man, we're really starting to clear this area out, aren't we? No problem. Yep, this stone axe definitely uh, ain't the same <laughs> as the uh, as the obsidian. That's for sure. Okay, put that right there and right there. Oh, cool. Right next to it. No problem. Beautiful. And so far, we haven't seen that cat over here, but we know where he goes now. So, he hasn't seen us, but we have seen him. So, we know what area to either steer clear of or to go to if we want some kitty meat. That didn't sound right, but you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. I'm saying that without... No, no, I'm not even saying that. That's not what I'm saying at all. Anyway, how's the weather where y'all live? Um, it's great here, let me tell you. 
<laughs> oh, this might be a problem because I'm getting dirty. Okay. So we got one, two. I think we're going to have enough because there should have been a couple long sticks that fell. Where would they have fallen? Somewhere around here, right? Because I chopped down two of those. There's a long boy. There's one. The other one. There we go. I see you. I see you. I hear something out there. And of course I'm on edge because we just saw a jaguar. Oh, okay. I was like, why am I one short? I know I counted. That's right. How many do we have? None. We have none. I hear something out there. Oh, I see it now. Yeah, it's that armadillo. Okay, cool. Didn't think it sounded like a predator, but you never can tell. You know, their footsteps are a little bit slower. But, you know, in the moment, you just, especially after seeing one, it's like, you know what? I'm not going to take chances. I'm not going to count steps <laughs> to determine if I'm in danger or not. I'm going to look. And that's exactly, no, 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 no. I don't want that. This, okay, okay. The Deconstruct. There we go. This is going to be the one that's going to be open air. Okay. So what time is it? Oh, yeah. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is we're going to head down. We're going to we're gonna wash up. That sounds dangerous, doesn't it? Okay. We're going <laughs> to... We're going to go wash up in the dark is what we're going to do. Now, is there an easier way to get down there? I mean, there's a different way to get down there. I don't know that it's any faster. And at least we know that the... The cat does not path through this way. Or at least we feel pretty confident that it doesn't. So let's just keep going this way. We're going to wash up. And do we need more water in these? Yeah, one of them does. Every drop counts. Every drop counts. And I'm going to yeah head over here. Just so I can have my eyes up there. And I'm going to wash, 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 and even though it goes, it disappears, there's still dirtiness on there. So I want to get completely queen, 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 I want to get completely queen, I want to get completely clean by washing off completely to make sure I have zero dirt on me, especially considering it's such a pain. It's not a pain, it's just, it takes time to go up and down this way. Okay, so we've got that taken care of. Let's go ahead and address our vitals. Let's see how much time. Yeah, we don't have much time at all on that guy. We've got our soup. These guys are going to last a little while. We'll just eat one of these. Yes. I'm going to go ahead and eat these. The soup lasts a while. We can always find more mushrooms and stuff like that. Oh, you know what? Actually, now that I think about it, were both of them carbs? It's okay. If we waste a little bit, if we splurge and gorge, it's not an issue. So I'm going to head back over to our base. I think I'm going to get some shut eye. Oh gosh, yeah, we need we need sleep. It's it's 1230. Way past daddy's bedtime. So I'm going to get this guy back to the base. <laughs> okay. Will I, though? That's what happens when you try to take a different route. Look at that. Okay, well maybe that means that predators don't path up there as well. Um, you never know. You never, never know. But yes, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. And I love comments from everybody. I'd love to see more comments from, from people, especially um, what you would consider a unique uh, space that you've built a base on. Um, I'm very interested in hearing that. But yes, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you when I see you.